It's a lot of fun to have a new beverage to serve on New Year's Eve or on New Year's Day if you're having friends over for brunch. So today, you know, a typical brunch drink might be champagne and orange juice. That's called a mimosa. Well, today I'll show you how to make a pomosa using pomegranate juice and a couple other citrusy flavors that make it so refreshing and a little bit different. So we're going to start by with the pomegranate juice actually and I'm just going to put two ounces or four tablespoons of pomegranate juice in each tall glass and the thing about serving this drink is that it has a lot of health benefits it's loaded with antioxidants pomegranate juice you've probably heard a lot about it lately it's just always in the news and they're they're always telling us that it has more antioxidants than green tea than cranberry juice or blueberry juice so oh and even red wine so it's really quite good for you. And then we're gonna add some citrusy flavor with about an ounce or two tablespoons of orange juice into each glass. And that gives it a nice bit of vitamin C. And then another ounce or two tablespoons of limeade. And that makes it very refreshing. So we'll get that in there. Now if you wanted to, you could just make a big punch bowl full of this mixture and just have everyone serve themselves when they come in. Today we're gonna to top this off with a nice sparkling pear juice. If you wanted to make it an alcoholic beverage, you could use champagne or you could use some Prosecco, which is a sparkling Italian wine. The pear juice is a lot like Prosecco. It just has that fruity pear flavor. I'm gonna mix this up and then just float a little wedge of fresh orange and fresh lime in each of these drinks. Isn't that pretty? And let's give it a little taste, see how it is. Oh, that is so good. If you didn't want to use the sparkling pear juice, I just found this in the local grocery store. You could also use any of the carbonated lemon lime beverages like 7-Up or Sierra Mist or even ginger ale would be good too. But if you can find some sparkling pear or peach juice, ooh, that is really good. So there we go. I'm calling it a pomosa. And give it a try on New Year's Eve or New Year's Day for brunch. It'll be perfect. Get the recipe at www.lakelandpeach.com. I'm Sue Doden and now we're cooking.